Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Zach and today I'm going to be looking at some Omi price, some Ecomi stuff and some BB stuff as per usual. Today right now, the current price is 0.003245 on a low, or sorry, not on low, sorry, down 6.6% and we're on a low of 0.003024 and a high of 0.003629. Currently, honestly, things are looking pretty much stable. I mean, obviously we've had a bit of ups and downs, but like I say, generally pretty stable. As I suspected, we were going to hit the twos and of course that is what we did, but now we're already back up to the threes who knows do you think it's gonna dip even further i'd love to hear your thoughts on that but that is not what this video is all about i want to speak about the new collectibles that we could see from the dc universe that dan c has spoken about in clubhouse very recently if you've already watched this clubhouse video and you're getting tired of it i do apologize but there is so many gems in this we're going to be talking about this uh clubhouse probably for the next week there's so much to go through and of course then we have even more to go through very soon with other stuff coming up but that being said i want to have a look at some DC collectibles that are coming up soon. Dancy speaks more on it here. Yep, let's just fire away. I am on a little bit of a time limit, so um, let's get through. Wanted to, uh, you wanted to share with us a little bit about what you personally are most excited about in the next coming weeks. Uh, next coming weeks, um, uh, I mean, next coming weeks is probably, yeah, all months. I mean, I'll, I'll get a little bit more long term. I mean, in the coming week, next coming weeks, we've got some really cool um, new categories from uh, the DC range of collectibles. Um, very, very Ooh. beautiful uh, collectibles. So I'm, I'm pretty excited about dropping them. That's all we need to hear right now from Dan C. I mean, I've I've posted this entire me reacting to this clubhouse. So if you want to check that out, there will be a link in the description if I can remember to. That being said, he's saying about different categories. Now, we have already seen very recently, i.e. today, we saw Batman Black and White Series 5, where we saw a number of different Batman NFTs. We, of course, saw number 89 Batman. We saw, of course, Robin. We saw another Batman and another Batman right here. And, of course, these were really awesome. Lots of good reception. I think some people were a bit annoyed at how fast they sold out, especially the ultra rares. But realistically, we have thousands and thousands of people who are trying to get in. And there's only actually, like, how many ultra rares were there? They were, like, only... 3,800 ultra rares. I'm pretty sure there were tens of thousands of people trying to get in. So of course, it's going to sell out quickly. Having said that, what I'm more interested in right now is looking at Trevor's Twitter right here, because as we can see, Trevor does tweet quite a lot. We're going to look at some of the stuff um, that he's posted recently. For one, as a developer, the fact that you can see the front face of the side walls through the back face of the front uh, wall makes me physically ill. What a pile of chank. But either than that, sorry, but either, yeah, but either than that, this collection and the vid is awesome. Now we're going to have a look at that real quick. But first of all, Batman versus Catwoman. Now I'm trying my best not to take everything that Trevor says as something that, oh, it's going to be something cool. But he is a lot lead content producer and he's kind of the best or one of the best people within Ecomi to sort of look towards for uh, teasers. Now, of course, this was here, Batman versus Catwoman, just chill prints. Of course, we see Batman here, but we actually have to expand the image. And of course, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we, yeah. Uh, so we have, yeah, we have a uh, Prince maybe versus Batman. And um, this, this, is, this is incredible, right? That, that is amazing. All I want to see is Batman fly now. Having said that, obviously we have others here. We have, of course, Batman with the dog right here. This looks a little bit, um, <laughs> the dog just, <laughs> just looking into the camera like, what's going on? Obviously, and this is what's a bit scary, right? It's obviously to the dog, there is nothing right here, <laughs> like nothing at all. So they're probably just wondering what the hell's going on. But yeah, Trevor does definitely tweet a lot. There's definitely some memes here. That being said, what I'm really trying to go over here for one, let's have a quick look at this. Of course, here we have what looks like a Ritmo. I probably looked like a full of the park, but I got this dope video showing off the vault in AR. Everything looks amazing. Well done. And the crazy part is we're just getting started. And of course, right here, of course, we have Harley Quinn. Wow. So actually, I want to have a quick look at this because this looks really awesome. So we have Ritmo here. I'm wondering why, why we can't see Ritmo being animated. Is this not one of the animated Ritmos? I don't know because I don't own I don't own Ritmos. So we have, of course, Harley Quinn right here. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is crazy. And I, I can understand why they think that maybe people will think they're looking crazy when um, they're literally just filming nothing to other people. That That is crazy, though. We literally have a vault opening. <laughs> I love this. This is what I love about this stuff. This is what I truly love about this stuff. Because this, this stuff's going to end up on TikTok at some point. All we need is for one of the biggest TikTokers out there to post something. And this is just going to blow up. Even not one of the biggest TikTokers. TikTok has such good organic growth um that or organic reach that this is just truly uh mind-blowing really just 
I, I, I'm so, I'm so happy about this stuff because you just know that this person is literally still in the park, right? But actually, in alternate reality, no, they are not. They are, they're, 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 they're in the vault, in the park, looking at all this stuff. That being said, the main thing about this video right here is, of course, Catwoman and, of course, Batman. Now, I have shown this already, but some of you may not have seen it. Thankfully, Robbie Remington, again, a huge thank you, Robbie Remington, for sending us over. They sent over something from the Facebook group with Michael Stamp posting about it showing us what seems to be some things that Vivi has liked on Instagram and this is perfect way for uh, Vivi to tease stuff when they like stuff it's like oh we're maybe working with them etc so we have like Batman of course Batman we have Final Fantasy right here and then we have Batman with the Joker the Batman and we have Catwoman right here now obviously that could be mean nothing or it could mean that we will in fact see of course Catwoman here now I have done research but I honestly can't find any Catwoman on Vivi of course we do have Harley Quinn but we only have Batman to Apart from that, I mean, honestly, this is what Batwoman could look like, maybe is NFT form, so that's kind of cool. But the main thing is, is that we really could see a Batmobile here. You know, if they're talking about putting in NFTs that are a different category, but within the DC universe, you know, we already have characters, but do we have any Batmobiles? Obviously, we have the DeLoreans. We've already seen cars and vehicles within Vivi. This, in my opinion, could definitely be a huge step in uh, in marketing for one, in marketing within Vivi having these I, I mean i can just this itself i can just imagine it being an nft right now like in an ar like it just it, it makes sense to me and so therefore leading on from that i wonder what else could we see regarding new categories within the dcu the first thing that comes to me of course like i say is the batmobile because that leads so um nicely i suppose from the delorean but honestly i'm not sure because i personally have not watched all the dc films nor have i read any of the comics basically so i'm definitely not an expert with this but i am trying to think about what are the opportunities here regarding nfts that aren't necessarily just uh playable or ar figures essentially i'd love to hear your thoughts on this though i mean now that i think of it i feel like we could even see like batman weapons maybe within vv i don't know how that would fly but of course i think we might have seen this itself in Fortnite, maybe we'll see some sort of Batman explosive batarang. That would be kind of cool, like just throwing out batarangs in the park or even in the house. Of course, it's not going to break anything because it's digital. I'm not sure how a Batman grapnel gun would work, but it would surely be interesting. But that's all I can really think about regarding DC objects. Like I say, simply because I'm not a DC person. But yeah, definitely let me know what you're thinking about in the comments below. I just saw this on Trevor's account honestly this stuff is awesome he retweeted this from captain omi out of curiosity actually how many of you were able to buy an nft personally i have not been able to get it i'm not awake at the time when it comes out and honestly this isn't my only project i do run a number of projects online this is just one of them but i definitely plan on but i definitely plan on getting one soon that being said i hope this video was interesting or helpful to you if it was a like as always well, i would appreciate it if you're interested in following me on twitter my handle is at zaki i cover a lot of stuff regarding omi vivi and the comey on there but with that being said have a great day everyone and i will see you in the next video